Just don't get too crazy. Just be like, you know, like, like, you know, like, dodge, dodge. Okay. And duck. And uh, a blade flies at you. <laughs> okay, uh, one more. You have to like that. It's like flies at your chest. Like, okay. Oh, sorry, my hand got in the shot. Right now, we are uh, actually shooting the reveal of the house, the, the scene where the the car are, you know, because we can't get one of the, we don't have a car crappy enough to be one of the gypsy cabs from Royal Tender Bombs, but uh, where the car pulls off and drops Bobby Drake off, and so uh, we have to make sure that we show, you know, we have a good view of the house because that's a lot of our production value, and that's one of the things that I think, like, makes the video cool, the fact that of all the Wes Anderson parodies people have made, we're the only one to actually use the house. And do it one more time. After you do it, kind of like look up as like the ice spreads out. Gotcha. And go. We're shooting on the Panasonic GH4. Mm -hmm. uh, mostly because, being as this is a Wes Anderson video, there have to be slow motion shots, and this shoots 96 frames per second, while most cameras only shoot 60. So, uh, so that was crucial. Also, it shoots 4K, and so I kind of figured, why not? Let's let's really go for it and shoot it in 4K. Just in terms of relative to the first time. And still, in terms of still not being sure if I'm doing it right, this is no, the best no, no, no. one yet. Uh, no, wait, but actually, serious question. Bow tie, the middle of the knot is usually not like that, right? It's, it's usually, usually smaller. smaller. Right? Yeah. Okay. The team that we're using in this is the original X Men team. And the original X Men were all in matching yellow and blue uniforms, which works well with the Wes Anderson aesthetic because, like, you know. Like Bottle Rocket, they have the yellow drum suits. And so to me, it made the most sense to buy yellow drum suits and then use blue accents on them. I was thinking a mix of, like, use the colors from the original X Men, which are also used in X Men First Class. But um, the design uh, sort of based it partly on the 80s X Factor costumes and also the uh, the leather jacket designs from Grant Morrison, Frank Whiteley's new X Men run, with the X's on, on the chest and then the stripes on the arms. Today we're shooting what I think is gonna put us on top of every other Wes Anderson parody that has been made because what they don't have, and we do, is a miniature cross-section model of a primary location. Uh, in this case it is the, uh, the Xavier Mansion, of course built basically like a dollhouse uh, and it was built by Ben McCrell, who's a very talented theater uh, stage designer. We've got Jean Grey's room, Scott Summers' room, the library, and the danger room slash gym in the basement. And so we're shooting these shots going through the cross section of the house, and we've shot actors on a green screen, and so we're going to add them inside of it, similar to the shot in the Life Aquatic that goes through the cross section view of the boat. This is the coolest thing that's ever been in any video we've ever made. It, like, that's not an exaggeration. It really is. It's amazing. I love it so much. Yeah, well,